Hey, Mo, why don't you let me get another cup of that stuff you call coffee? Hey, you ever meet a man that touched your memory just so that you knew way down deep inside that you'd never forget him? Well, you know, I recall an old man just about like that when I was knocking around Louisiana a couple of years ago. Why don't you come on over and sit down a bit? I want to tell you a little story about him. I knew a man, Bojangles, and he danced for you. In worn out shoes, silver hair, ragged shirt, and baggy pants. The old soft shoes. He jumped so high. He jumped so high. Then he lied. I met him in the cell in New Orleans. I was down and out. He looked to me to be the eyes of age as he spoke. Right on. He talked of life. He talked of his life. And then he laughed and shook his clothes all around. Mr. Bojangle. Mr. Bojangles, Mr. Bojangles, go on and dance. He danced for those in minstrel shows and county fairs. Around the south, then he spoke with tears. How for fifteen years his dog and him traveled about, and then one day his dog up and died. He just up and died. And after 15 years, that old man still grieves. Well, now I dance every chance I get down to the honky tonks. Well, I dance for drinks and chips. But most of the time I spend right here at these candy bars. You see, I drink a bit, but there was a time, was a time, do that to choose. One day we'd be here, the next day we might be anywhere. Be a little spiny. Well, I wonder why this dog don't get to live too long. But he still gotta die old. Well, I reckon it just as well he's gone now. Cause I really wouldn't want him to see me like I am. But you know something, mister? I sure do miss that old dog. He shook his head. And as he shook his head. I heard somebody say, "Hey, Mister, would you dance for us, please?" <laughs>